Hi, this is Riaz from Networks Learning. Welcome to Cisco Next Generation Firewall Training. In this lab, we will configure quality of service on FTD. Uh, FTD supports traffic rate limiting through a quality of service policy and uh, only evaluated for traffic matching access control policy. Uh, if, in, if a traffic is matching access control policy, then only in that case, the quality of service policy will be working. FTD supports one active quality of service policy at a time. So we will take a look on how we can configure quality of service in this lab. So let me show you the uh, lab topology first. This is my lab topology. This is my FTD and it's connecting to outside network and inside network. So let's go to the quality of service in device and QoS. Here at QoS policy, we need to define a new policy. We will create a new policy with the name of RGS LCMP QoS. We will specifically implement uh, QoS on our ICMP traffic and uh, the devices that are uh, targeted for this policy is RGS and GFW PRI. This is my policy. Inside this policy, we can create multiple rules. Based on these rules, you can have a rate limit and you can configure rate limit for uh, uh, multiple traffic types based on your requirements. You can configure uh, rate limiting based on interface objects, based on networks, applications, ports, URLs, SGTs, IC attributes as well. So we uh, will name this as all ICMP quality of service interface in interfaces in source interface objects apply quality of service on interfaces in destination interface objects. So source interface means the source interface is the download and uh, destination interface objects is the upload. No, no. Uh, it's not the upload and download basically the download limit is this and upload limit is this interface in source interface objects and interface in destination interface objects means that on which interface you want to apply the policy and this based on this the the download and upload uh, you know tabs are also changed as well so if I configure that is at a destination interface object, my upload limit will be as the uh, download and my download will be as upload, you know. So be careful by implementing this. So I will be configuring interface and source interface object. Or I will be configuring interface and destination objects. This will be my download speed. So source interface is my inside zone or inside interface group and destination is outside interface or interface group and at port level I can configure my port I want to block, uh, rate limit the ICMP traffic so I can add selected destination port as ICMP so I will download uh, the limit to 0 0.008 MB uh, megabits per second and you can click on ok then you click on save and you click on deployment over here once the deployment is finished I will be back and will test the results and will show you So the deployment is successfully completed and let me show you the results of the quality of service policy that we have recently applied uh, on access uh, from this access client machine I have uh, initiated something with uh, uh, ICMP traffic along with ICMP traffic I have also configured HTTP and HTTPS traffic quality of service and I have limited uh, the bandwidth for these connections 
so i have initiated uh, some kind of traffic uh, you know icmp traffic and http https traffic based on this we can see that uh, the or the the packets are being dropped in quality of service policy is being applied to there from cli you can verify it by show service policy policy command uh, which will uh, show you that the configured rate is 1000 bytes and confirm 1931 interface you can also verify it under the summary dashboard you have the uh, quality of service tab in the quality of service tab you will see different categories and uh, different uh, uh, you know mechanism how the quality of service is uh, is uh, is working on your uh, network here we can see that quality of service dot traffic by application based on applications mostly https traffic is being uh, dropped against the quality of service policy which we have applied and uh, the network protocols uh, web browser web service provider search engines so this is how you can configure the uh, uh, you know quality of service policy again let me show you now i have made some changes to the quality of service policy you can re verify it basically uh, i was unable to uh, produce uh, so much amount of data using the icmp so that's why i also included the other two applications uh, including http and https so this is how you can implement quality of service in uh, at uh, ftd so thanks for watching